Hey everyone, another very special guest for me today. Another one of our sponsors. Uh, I've got Dustin here from Smile ID. Um, we've also had Mark on the podcast before. We have. Uh, I, I'm sorry, he's just flown into uh, Cape Town as well. That's we, right. We, we just, just missed him. him. Yeah, yeah. yeah. it's a shame, but uh, you've been great. Uh, thank you very much for your support. Thank you for your sponsorship. I'm, I'd love to hear from you because you obviously go to lots of different events. Um, how, how was this? I mean, was it quite different? Was it? Did you guys get much? Not talking about sort of business, but in terms of information and. Uh, understanding of the sector and understanding of people's problems. Yes, I mean, I think firstly, just thanks so much for putting this event together. I think uh, what the sense that I got was you were really trying to break the mold of the traditional conference. Um, we all in this space attend loads and loads of conferences every year. Um, often it's difficult to get a lot out of the content I found, but I think you guys really nailed that, that, that part of it. So um, I think like the broad spectrum of what you brought to it was mm -hmm. like, uh, getting sort of uh, ex-career criminals to that have turned their life around and shared insights around uh, what they're seeing yeah. all the way through to uh, like what types of fraud we're seeing in the industry, what solutions there are, and then also kind of getting everyone to get into the mind of a criminal and actually um, try and uh, turn the tables. Uh, thought that was really fascinating and then sharing that with the audience and I think the audience participation in general was fantastic. So had a lot of great conversations and I uh, just thought uh, you guys got it spot on. That's awesome. Um, you're, yeah, I think you may, may have just alluded to it, but your, your favorite part of the event? Uh, yeah, I mean, I think just uh, um, putting on uh, the hat of, of a criminal for a very short space of time just to uh, see what it's like and be creative in that space. And, and ultimately, I think coming out of that is, is like uh, sort of showing us where the gaps are in our uh, systems and processes and uh, and that type of thing. And I think that was super interesting and it, it helped to, to kind of highlight for everyone, like the real extent of the problem, but also, um, where we can all stand up and, um, and try and help to solve it. And I think as you quite rightly said, this is about a collective, right? Not one single entity or company can solve financial crime. This is about everyone working together, public sector, private sector, and everyone in between, right? Absolutely. Yeah. And, and I think, um, I think everyone that I spoke to over the, the past two days really shared that sentiment. So that's super encouraging for us. And, uh, I'm looking forward to the next one. Amazing. Listen, thanks again. I'll let you get back. Thanks, Derek. Thank you.